Hey YouTube, uh, it's been a while since I made my last video. I wanted to post this, uh, this one here um, that I just made on my uh, kayak cart. Uh, this is my Beaver Tail Stealth 2000 kayak. And uh, this thing's really heavy, as you know. I think the website says they weigh about 130 pounds uh, dry. And uh, I've added a few things to mine to make it a little bit more comfortable for me and uh, more stable. So uh, it weighs a little bit more than this, th just your stock ones. Uh, I added a seat down on the floor level so it would add greater stability uh, while paddling. And then if I wanna set up in this top one right here, uh, I can plop it up and, and uh, set in it for casting. But uh, I prefer to just sit down on the bottom when it gives the, the boat a, a lot more stability and anyways uh when you're trying to lug this thing around it's it's no fun so i uh made a kayak cart and it's basically like the the last one that i built um so anyways it's a one inch square tubing and uh i just come up uh off the side of the tubing and made a place uh, that kind of hugs the contour of the boat and then i took and put a an eye uh, put an eyelet through there and what i do is take um just a a cam buckle strap and wrap it through that eyelet all the way around the top of the boat and it'll work for pretty much any kayak uh, you can put anything on here it don't have to be just a beaver tail stealth 2000 it'll work on any kayak so like i said i just put an eyelet down there and then uh for the axle i went and got a real real heavy uh duty bolt and you can see, you can see it comes through there and uh, you're not gonna break that one. I, the first kayak cart I built, I used bicycle tires and uh, a bicycle axle. And this kayak's so heavy that it bent the axle. So uh, I just said the hell with it. And I went to uh, Northern Tool and bought some really heavy duty wheels. They've got the bearings inside of them. And uh, I don't think that these are gonna be uh, bent or broken anytime soon. So uh, Anyways, uh, I just wanted to show you how easy it it uh, rolls and uh, I'm gonna have my wife uh, uh, Come over here and roll it around Let me tighten that strap up. There we go So we're in my garage right now, so I'm gonna have her pick it up And you can see how easy that thing rolls There's a water hose right here. Uh, she's fixing to run over. You can see that it takes it over the water hose like nothing. And uh, we take this uh, this kayak down some really steep banks. We leave the cart on it and uh, it's very, very manageable. Before, we always ended up in a fight trying to get this thing down to where we needed to go. and and uh it was just a big headache and as you see now it makes it um, really easy to get around one thing you will notice and i'll try to zoom up with the camera um you can see the ground clearance uh, it's got a lot of ground clearance so when if you're going over tree roots or banks and and uh getting over rocks that's in the water uh it's no problem yeah if you uh uh go with a cart like this you got good ground clearance the we the wheels make it easier to to pull over bigger obstacles you can push it you can pull it it doesn't matter uh, sorry about the video work here my camera's not wanting to focus very good but uh that's where we're at uh, that's uh my version of the uh kayak cart will not break this one so uh go out and make you one 